Nine of your sides, Amber Joseph joins us live from the stadium tonight as the teams are getting ready. Amber. Can the teams are going through their intake process today. The young ladies will start practicing tonight and local leaders say that the World Series will be an economic boost to the area and will put Greenville on the map for even more sporting events. We're working really hard to make sure that um, that all the young ladies and their coaches and their families have a great experience here in Greenville, and, um, and I, I'm pretty confident that they will. Greenville Little League's Commissioner Brian Weingartz and his team have been preparing Stalling Stadium for weeks to host the Little League Softball World Series. Now the 10 teams are here and ready to hit the field. They're getting outfitted in uniforms. Um, they'll be over here at the park uh, later on getting their pictures taken. Each team has received 99 tickets to invite guests. Mayor PJ Conley says this is a home run for Greenville in terms of the economy. You know, over the last year and a half, it has been very tough for our local economy. Uh, we've had a lot of tourism dollars that have not come to our area like we normally do. So have a guest come here and visit, stay in our hotels, go to our restaurants, go to our local uh, businesses that have suffered over the last year and a half will be very exciting uh, and it'll infuse our economy. So we're excited to welcome them. The tournament will also put Greenville on the map, attracting even more sporting events to the area. This is a great opportunity for us to showcase um, that we have such a, uh, a great background for sports in our community, that we've got the facilities to be able to host an event of this caliber. Uh, we'll be on a national uh, television station, uh, so people throughout the entire country and even the world will be able to, to focus in and, and look at uh, Greenville. The league says it is committed to keeping everyone COVID safe, so there are protocols in place. Now, the teams will start practicing tonight. The games start on the 11th, and the series ends on the 18th. Live in Greenville, Amber Joseph, 9 on your side. Amber, thank you.